Y'all know what time it is. We're about to hit up The Walking Dead, Season 1, Episode 3. Oh. Right, let's get started. First, I'm going to turn that fan off, of course, because it is quite loud. Uh, there we go. Just adjust that. Oh. Turn that down. So there we go, Season 1, Episode 3, Long Road Ahead. Got a little energy, energy booster. Why did I call it an energy booster? It's an energy drink. Oh man! Previously on the Walking oh, here we Dead. Go, here we go. Get the gates open! We've got wounded. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. Words getting out that you want to leave the motor in. Well, here isn't doing us any good. You should think about coming with us, you and Clem. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. Those look like the people who raided my Calm camp. Calm down, you're paranoid. Fuck you! Did you tell anyone out there who you were, or that you were tied to this place? That's right. I know who you are, and I know you're a killer. He's not dead! Somebody help me! Come on! Well, we know this I'm guy's not gonna make it. Get it. Oh, what the fuck? Sounds like a car. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Don't worry, little girl. Bandit's got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. Hit it up, hit it up, hit it up. Huh. Well, I seen something then. Right. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, still, still waiting to start, mate. Here we go. Hope you all enjoy. Follow me. Looks like this is our lucky day. Mm. I don't like it. Keep your eyes open, all right? Just trying to be optimistic. Let's just get inside. Up your mind yet? About what? When it comes to the getting the hell out of Macon, I bet you're in the let's stay put camp considering I've been pushing everyone to leave. We should go. We should go. Motel's run its course, and it's not safe. Well, if that's what you think, you should probably fucking speak up. Lily's dug in. Just like last time. Over the rig, into the pharmacy, and scrape together whatever supplies are left. We didn't leave much in there. Hey, we're out of options. Something's better than nothing. <laughs> Shit. You okay? The ladder's come loose. I'm not sure how many more trips she's got in her. I'm not sure how many more trips we've got in us. 
No kidding. So you have to try to climb it either way. Looks like she's had it. What now? I'll find another yeah. way up. Right. In a bit. Better get a move on. Yeah. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. There's no safe way through Sorry, that, that mess. That little pause thing just come up. Uh, just had a little conversation about uh, parents going shopping, so. <clears throat> Take the handbrake off. Huh. Probably something around there, surely. Are you sure you can't reach me? Listen, you're either gonna have to get a hell of a lot taller, or my arms are gonna have to get a hell of a lot longer. I get it. I'll keep looking. Okay. So I've searched over this side. Hmm. They're blocked by all the fallen concrete. Ah, 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 seeing it. Not doing so good, huh? She'll be fine. If you say so, you're the only one she seems to give a damn about anymore. Well, you and Clem. Do we push it or whatever? There we go. Ooh, that is making a bit of noise. Girl still upset with you for agreeing to take that stuff from the station wagon. I think she understands. Hope so. Not like we had much choice. Right. Duck was asking about that guy at Herschel's farm out or something. Really? I wasn't sure it phased him. Of course it did. It was a scary situation for him, Sean dying and all. I'm just worried he'll always think it was his fault. You're sure you're up for this? Lee, I'm fine. I've got this. Give me your hand. Oh, shit. How much more noise you want to make? That's got to cause the racket. Jesus, are you okay? No, Dick, I'm shot. Now get ah! off here. Scream, do they? Jesus, I don't think so. It's a girl. She's gonna get us killed. No shit. Oh, she's been dead. Fuck. Gotta shoot. 
put her out of this misery. You know we're here. What do you mean? I mean, we leave her alive, and she draws them all to her, buying us time. Yeah, think about it. We're always worrying about the ones we can't see. She stays alive and brings them all out of their holes. Those time we, we need to think of ourselves as well. We need to survive. We need to survive. So, we should be good to clear this place out, but we ain't got all day. Get everything you can out of these racks. Don't forget underneath the counter this time. I'll clear down here and then we gotta go. much time now. You're back. Ben found some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea. That's neat. I'll find you in a minute. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. So, what did you get? 
Just what was left. Which was a lot, actually. Take a look. We're fine, by the way. Nice work. This'll keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. We have to go eventually, Lily. I know, Lee. I know. Eventually is different. So, you two are, uh, having a disagreement? Cool it, Doug. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable any- We're strongest together. I know you think I'm on her side, but there are no sides, damn it. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's gotta be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We well, have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. No, because Lee knows how to take care of people, not just things. What about medicine? We got plenty of food from that station wagon. We can't just keep our fingers crossed for more station wagons. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? Your pal and I got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. And you just let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? You weren't out there. There was no saving her? Don't take that tone with him. It's the first smart thing he's done in a while. She was dead anyway. It made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. Look, Macon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on Earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? What I know?! I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies! That's right, stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! Now everybody get out! Stealing? She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. All I know is, whenever this shit happens, I'm the fucking bad guy. I'd like a thank you for once. For once! I do apologize for these pauses. I had an achievement there then, and I couldn't see the last uh, um, option. Rough day, I guess. Yep, I've just been calling them days lately. I don't know what it is, but it's probably worth talking to Lily about things going missing. Ever since her dad died, she's been a live wire. And now, if she's paranoid, that's a bad mix. Let's go talk to Lily then. Uh, actually, where's Clem first? That's right. Let's speak to these guys outside. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Uh, you need to try harder with Lily. You guys trust everyone here about the guns. You guys, uh, trust everyone here? More or less. I obviously have my problems with Lily, but I don't distrust her. Yeah. We can't turn on each other any more than we have. About the guns. Don't you start. I just wanted to say, Cat, it's probably good they make you uncomfortable. Thank you, Lee. But we need them. There's no doubt about that. I'll talk to you later. I'm not going to say they need to try harder with Lily, because... Uh, right, let's go talk to the Mardi woman. Pardon me. 
I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? You'll have to chill out. I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. Things are missing, and I could use your help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking things. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. Lily. It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Seems like you're manufacturing this from nothing. Prove me wrong. I'd really appreciate it. Right, well, so looks like I'm going on a... A mystery. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. Um, I heard you guys talking. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson, your ward. That's Robin. I know who it is. Bye. Okay, you're Robin. Yes. What do I do? I, I don't know. Go look around. Let me know if you find anything weird. I'm on the case. Keep a kid happy by keeping a kid quiet. Right, so let's go have a little look see, shall we? Do you guys know anything about this broken flashlight? Fuck. We don't got many of those. Yeah, it's a problem. The glass and the bulb are all busted out. I saw some broken glass over by the ice machine. I meant to clean it up before the kids hurt themselves on it. I forgot, though. Hmm, so maybe we should go check over there. Where's Clem again? Clem again? Clementine. The flashlight was broken. Was it you? No. You're not in trouble if it was. I know you get nervous and maybe you went out to go to the bathroom, broke it, got worried and tossed it. What's with the third degree? I didn't break any flashlight. Okay then. It seems positive. It seems positive. Hey, Doug. Hiya. Do you know anything about this flashlight? Well, I can tell Ooh, you... Wait, 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 wait. I know you know everything about this flashlight. I'm asking if you know how it got busted. Lily found it in the dumpster. Oh, no. No, I don't. I'll keep my eye out for some suitable parts, though. That'll give me something useful to do. What's up? Why would I want to look at the RV? Hmm. Okay, so there's an X. Hmm. Chuck. Pink. Hmm. Duck. A clue. Maybe. What do you think it is? I don't think it's anything. Maybe it's a sign. It could be. It's pink chalk, which is weird. Okay, back to investigating. Hmm. That's where Clem is. Let's go over and have a little... Where...
I don't get the Clementine then. Where the hell was she? Where's she down here? There we go. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. Do, uh, you have any pink chalk? No, it's gone somewhere. Hmm. Do you want blue? No, no, it's okay. Psst, Lee. I found something. What is it? I found this piece of pink chalk and a scuff of it over by the gate. Really? Totally. I was coming to see him for clues and... Yeah, Duck, I got it. Good job. <laughs> So leave him hanging. Ah, oh, sure. Cool. You didn't break the flashlight, did you, Duck? No. Mom and Dad won't let me touch any of their stuff. Lily neither. That's probably for the best. Hmm. Oh, what's up? Dog scoff. Mm. Somebody was over here too. See, I did good, huh? Yeah, duck. You did. I suppose I should go out there and look around. You stay here this time. Seriously. Okay. Where am I going? Motel sign. Okay, you can walk a bit more this way by the looks of it, so. Great. Someone's been stealing. You haven't come up with anything, have you? I came up with this. It's got a bunch of meds in it. It was in a grate on the outside wall. And there's a sign on the other one. Holy fuck. Yeah. Okay, we line everybody up. Everybody. Somebody is killing us. Stealing from that supply is the same as slipping into your room at night and cutting your throat while you sleep. You die. What is the difference? What if Clementine gets sick and we don't have what we need? What the hell? You don't fucking steal from us! Who the fuck is that? Yo, Got our people out there! Out we ain't fucking around! What do we do? Oh, Lily. shit! They're gonna start kicking in doors any second. Lily, what the hell are you- Stall him. What? Just keep him talking. Do whatever it takes to stop him pulling the trigger. You made the biggest mistake of your life. Oh. oh shit. Enough oh, of this bullshit. Drew, stop putting your boot to these doors. Yeah. Hold it, asshole. Take it easy. Why are you doing this? Just leave us the fuck alone! Why? This fucking guy. Why? Because we got her! That's why! What will it take to reach a deal? About twice as much as you've been giving us. You got it. Done. Is that so? Well, I suppose we ought to hash out some terms then. I don't like no hash. Man, shut up or I'll... Christ! Oh shit! I shot him in the ass. Oh, for God's sake. Get back there! Smoke him out! We gotta get out of here! No shit! Get those bastards! Cover our people and get them to the RV! Around shit, the brain is right there. Now, get over here, hurry! Man, you 
saved our asses. Get inside! Hang on! Oh, Where is he? He's right behind that van! Get the from behind! Oh. Oh. Well, <laughs> shit. And everyone's good. Everyone's good. Cat, Jesus, are you okay? I'm fine. I'm fine. Oh shit! Oh shit! Oh shit! I'm sorry. Calm down. Hit the we roll. need to figure out why this happened. Nobody died. We're okay, right? Katya, you're okay? We just lost everything. But we have our health. Cat's head is split open. I'm fine. Somebody in here caused this. Settle down back there. The bandits have had our number for weeks. This is different. Somebody was working with them. Whoever it was was slipping them our meds. They didn't get their last package, so they attacked. Calm down back there. That's nuts. Lee found a bag of supplies hidden outside the wall. It's true. So, Ben, I think we need to talk. Whoa, what? Lily, let's think about this logically, no? Logically? The new guy who could have easily been a plant? I think that's pretty logical, Doug. You think I'd do anything to hurt you guys? Don't play dumb. Were you hoping they'd eventually kill us all and you could join them? Why Ben? What makes you think it was him? He's always so eager to see what supplies we found. He came into this crew as stranger from the woods. It's pretty cut it does and make sense. I came into this crew as a stranger. So you're saying you did it? Nobody did anything! I know I don't get wrapped up in the politics around here, but we really need to think before we start stringing somebody up. Doug, I appreciate your concern, but we have all the evidence we need. You have evidence? No, not here, but Lee found the meds. We found an entire signaling system. Doug's right. Let's just get on down the road. We can talk this out like adults. Why give someone who almost killed us the opportunity? Lee, you know what we found. Just let me out of the car. I'll go. I didn't do it, but I'll go! Good. That sounds great. Lily, look at him! No one's gonna go. Fuck. Jesus, I didn't! Look me in the eyes and tell me you didn't have anything to do with it. I... Shit! What's going on up there? I hit something. We gotta stop. Alright, well, we can deal with this now, then. Kenny, is it safe? Should be. 
Everybody out. Lily? Out. Kenny, the RV has some surface damage, but there's a walker trapped underneath. God damn it. Everyone, keep your eyes peeled. You know what? We shouldn't just kick you out. We should hear what everybody thinks. I think you should chill out. Please, look, it wasn't me. Please stop accusing me. I'm really sorry you're upset, Ben. Just tell us you did it. I'm not doing this. Come on, Lee. You're the one who found them. You can't just abstain. Fuck all that. This is nuts. We're out here on the side of the road. Okay, fine then. Kenny? I don't know. Fuck. Just stop, would you? Well, your vote counts for you and Katja. We don't need all these votes. What do I have to do for you to trust me? I'll do anything. I'll, I'll do watches for months. Huh. The hell you will. I'll get more food, more medicine, anything. Just you think any of that is good now? Just let me stay, please. God, please. Stop panicking. Seriously, Ben. You need to stop and just take a breath. Do we need any more evidence than this? Evidence or not, this isn't any way to treat one of us. I've heard enough out of you, okay, Doug? Kenny, what's it gonna be? Just give me a damn minute. Ben, you have until Kenny kills that walker to tell me it was you. No! Ben! Lily! This is about trust, and I've never trusted you. Lily, they are. I can't, Lee. You know I Please can't. Please stop. Please don't kick me out of the group. We won't. Tell me. Now. Please, let's just get back in That's the That's not happening. I can't handle this. There. I got him. Now. What the fuck's the problem? Ben! No! Dog. She is tough. Drop it. Dead. What's happening? Keep duck away from the windows. Jesus Christ. Get in. We're leaving this crazy bitch. Definitely. I didn't mean to. It wasn't supposed to be him. What are we gonna do with her? Oh. Leave her for the walkers. Ken, leave. Yeah, I saw that. You're not coming with us. I'll die out here. I don't care. You're a murderer, Lily. We can't have you with us. I'm a murderer? You've had Lee with you this whole time. What are you talking about? He didn't tell you. He killed someone before all of this. He was a convicted murderer. Is that true, Lee? Shit. Yes. Fucking hell. Were you ever going to get around to telling me that? You got a little girl with you. To hell with it. Get in, Lee. Let's go, you guys. I don't have anything left. I don't know what to say. I didn't know one thing. Bye, Felicia. Lee, a word, please. I bet this is going to be about what she just said about me. What's up? Is Doug feeling all right? Oh, God. What the fuck? Happened during the raid. What's the plan? We've never had a bite victim in a group before. I'm going to keep an eye on him and see what I can do from a medical perspective. 
we keep the same plan unless something changes. East. Guys. What else is there to do? We thought you should know. Not that you've ever afforded us that type of luxury. Anyway, if you could tell Clementine, we would appreciate it. Oh. Clem, Clem, Clem. Your boy is dead. Duck is bitten. Or that. Huh? He got bit by a walker trying to escape the motel. I don't feel good. What about Doug? Gone, but won't come back. Because he was shot in the head. That's right. It's horrible. Yeah, it is. Dog. I like that guy. It's quiet, kept himself to himself. I'm glad I have Clem. I'm glad I have you. Me too. I heard you outside my treehouse that day and thought about dropping a hammer on your head. A charming! That's nice. I didn't, though. Gavard. Got something up ahead. It was just a. He must have fell asleep then. Oh, I thought I thought Clem. Damn bit, it! Oh, wow. Roads blocked. Oh man. Now we gotta deal with this. Deal with what? Of emails. Is there any way to get around it? Doesn't look like it. On foot, maybe. No, 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 Can't no. really afford to do that now. This seems like a safe area. All well, this brush will stop anything from creeping up on us. Why don't you and I go look around? Yeah, everyone else relax. Clem, stay close to Kitty and Cat, okay? Lee, if you come across anything to drink, uh, if there's a dining car or something, I think Duck's a bit dehydrated. It's a freighter, hon. Be careful in there. What? You think there might be something dangerous inside an abandoned locomotive? That would cross my mind. Right, let's speak to this guy first. I'm gonna spoke to him. Was it you? Not this again. Was it? No! Okay then. What would you have done with Lily? I don't know. Left her? I've never seen anybody kill someone like that before. Yeah, you've seen a bunch of other stuff by now. Yeah, but not like that. You, uh, happy you stayed with us all this time? Yeah. Really? It's with you guys or dead. I would have died out there in the woods. Just like my classmates. You think this is better? Yeah, of course. Open this up. 
So nö, dann. Wow. Somebody's been living in here. Yeah, man. Shit, think they're gone? I hope so. But this looks recently used. Be on the lookout and have your guard up. Map. A map of where the train goes. I think these tracks might lead to the coast. Route 27, Savannah. That's where Kinney's got us headed. Well. Uh. I'll take this to Kendra for Doc. Well, do anything, just step down a set. Go give this water to little old dog. No, dog, not dog. Dog's dead. Uh, here, found some water. Oh, thank you. Perfect. He's allergic to bees. Is that right? It's all I can keep thinking about. Like, somehow that matters. It doesn't. I know. Well, I don't, but you're probably right. We found this in the boxcar back there. Whoa, is this what it looks like? I think so. These tracks lead right to Savannah. Holy hell. Can you guys see about moving that thing? We could have something here. Yeah, we're on it. I'll speak to Clem. Hey, sweet pea. You okay out here? I don't think Doc feels good. He doesn't. Me neither. He doesn't. So, let's try and move this thing. So, here we go. Uh, okay. Engine compartment. No power. What's this one? So the middle one's got nothing at all. So engine compartment. Is this got where the power stuff is? No. Pistol with cab door. I mean, have we got to? <sighs> Suppose we gotta look him over. Yeah. Wow, he's had his face beaten. Or something. I don't think this guy came back. Christ. That light is blinking. Push it. Push it? Why not? Are you fucking serious? Here, look. Well. It's just the brakes. Okay, I'll give you that. This fucker works? Seems like it. I'll be damned. Uh, How the hell do we get it moving? I don't know. Uh, That's well, Mr. Amtrak over here. No clue. Well, let's look around. 
Maybe you'd go somewhere we'd like to be. Ben, if you could keep an eye on the girls and duck, I'd appreciate it. I'm gonna make sense of these controls. Man, this could be exactly what we need. I have no idea what to do with these. No. A bunch of maps about Georgia cities. Nothing about the train. Uh, hey, Ken. What's up? I don't know about leaving Lily, but the that's sort of. We need something to help us get the train going. God, we need some help getting this train going. People take notes, right, when we're working on stuff like this? Uh, we're smart guys, we can figure it out. I mean, does it want to talk you about Doug? talk about Doug? I'm really sorry, Kenny. Nobody deserves this. There's nothing to talk about. You heard Cat. He could be fine. We probably shouldn't ignore it. Nobody's ignoring nothing. I'm not worried. You shouldn't be either. There we go. I'll get back to it. Me too. Uh. Shit, this is it. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations from the writing. Underway. Shit, this oh, is I'm it. Done. Instructions on starting the engine. Damn, pages are gone. I can kind of see the indentations it from the writing. It's got indentation. Surely you can. I've got an idea. Nothing about the train. I've got an idea. I... Don't even know you can die this way. Jesus! Oh, you fucker! Oh! Designed to save lives. This door's gonna hurt. Okay, you aren't gonna like this. I'm sure you all knew where I was going with that though. I was gonna be really this way. Bam. Bam. Anything else in here that I can apparently salvage? I mean it doesn't look too healthy, does he? Leave him then. It's in pretty good shape for a wreck. I think it look at Rotten lunch. Ew. Ew. It's a bit unsure what I do with these animal crackers.
Here, I found these. If Duck's up for it. Thank you. That's very thoughtful. He isn't fussy, you know. What? Most kids, they're really fussy about what they'll eat. Hate vegetables, that kind of thing. Not Duck, huh? No. The most trouble I ever have is making him use a fork. Thank you, Lee. Sure. You're welcome. You are welcome. We found a notebook that we think might have had some starter directions on it, but the page is missing. Well, I'm sure you guys will figure it out. Why does everyone say that? Can no one be asked to do anything? There's a notepad on the train. Do you have any pencils or anything in your pack? Oh, yeah, no, to sketch. I wish. Ah. Oh. Maybe in the RV. What do you need it for? There used to be something written on the notepad that I need to know about. Oh. Well, if you don't end up using it, I'd take it. I like to put leaves between the pages and color over them. Like make a rubbing? Yeah, it's fun. Okay, okay, okay. There's something in the RV. Sure. Pencil, there we go. That's all I need from there. There we go. Perfect. You can read it now? Yeah. Should be able to just follow the steps to get the engine on. Sounds good. So. Six, five, six, five, nine, nine. Down, down, up, 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 down, up. You know what? I've got a little sneaky idea. I'm going to take a picture on my phone. There we go. There we go. Right. Oh. Right. Six. So down, down, up. Ah. Uh, up. There we go. And then up, down, up. Son of a bitch! Whatever you did, lit the dash up! So far, go. so good. Right, we need a five. Here we go. So. So. Just turn that one. Now we're talking! Right. Nine? What? Five, six, seven, eight. So where's nine? Was that the was that nine out here? Nine, here we go. Right, so we need to turn it left and then right. Let's 
There's nothing I can. T oh, here we go. So left. Then right. There we go. The power Holy of phone. Holy shit! We're golden. Yeah, we are. Golden. Man, feels good. Let's fucking enjoy this. Mum, let's see if she'll move. It's a bit loud, not gonna lie. Obviously it's a train, but... What's gonna stop us on a train? It's all yours. Boom. Still attached. Can you go find out where we're stuck? And get us unstuck? Yeah. That's where we're gonna be, be attacked. What a hell of a mess. So, okay, so if we jump back up here and go out the other side, and then this is basically where we're gonna be able to get the thingy unattached. This thing. Coupler. Ball. Shit. Broken. So you just basically only do the pen? There's gonna be a better way to do this. There's gonna be a better way to do this. That's definitely what's got to stuck. Okay, so now on one of the engine components, I noticed there was three. Let's go this way. I noticed there were three tools. I'm wondering one of them is what you need to use for the actual. I'll show you a look. Is it this one? these tools here uh, still the spike remover This, this has been going on for just over an hour now. I'm starting to think that this is going to roughly maybe get to the end a little bit. Maybe not. I say that on all of them, and they all there. surprise hey, me. Hey, Kenny, we're loose. Nearly two hours. So we've probably still got an hour to go. You touch any of my stuff? Is he? I took the map of the That's fine, you can have that. Really? Yeah, I got them all right up here. I guess it's no worse for wear. Name's Chuck. Charles, if you fancy. Lee. That your crew outside? Yeah. And the guy up in the cab. Him too. I saw you walking through here and thought about scaring the pants off you. What? But I couldn't force myself to do it. 
You're still kind of freaking me out. Train folk will do that. Already met everyone outside. They all warm to me right quick in direct sunlight. You met Chuck? Yeah, I did. It's so nice to meet someone normal for a change. He gave us candy, Ben too. That's nice. Nice guy. Welcome. Thank you. You met Kenny? Sure did. Man shares my love of the road. That's for certain. Sorry, your son's not feeling good. I appreciate your concern. Well, with a little TLC, I'm sure he'll be fit as a fiddle in no time. And I can offer y'all whatever I got, although it ain't much. Thank you. We'd like to do the same. Why don't we hold off on that? Stay with us. We'd like the company. Yeah. I'd agree with that. Mm -hmm. First impressions don't look like he can do much, but he knows the roots and stuff. So oh. that's it? We're cut loose? Seems that way, yeah. Great. We don't got much left, <coughs> so just gather whatever you have. <coughs> Let's go. Wanna ride? Well, it sounds like you're taking my home. That's a yes, then. Haven't found anything better for keeping the creepy crawlies out than that boxcar. Duck's sick. Get on the train, Clementine. He's getting sicker. Let me look at him. We can keep going if you want. Damn right I won't. That's what we're doing. I think Lee just wants to talk it through. It's talked through! Get on, cat. I'll be up front. I don't want to hear any nonsense he's, until we I get where we're going. I can see he's doing a Lily thing. When obviously she lost her dad and all this started up, then I can start to see my main man, Kenner, doing the same So hopefully he don't start going a wall, and hopefully I don't need to end up putting a bullet in his head. Because these two seem to get on well, I think. Might have little argues here and there, but the world they're living in is quite something at the minute. You gotta be hard on you, eh? Three adults taking care of three kids. No disrespect, son. We'll be fine. We've gone through just as much as anybody else. This one's gonna grow up quick. I already am. I don't doubt it, son. Lee! Lee, I need you right now. I need you to go get Ken. What's up? Would you get that off his face? My hands are full here. Could you just get that off his face, please? This is gonna be it, isn't it? He's out of time. We need to stop this train. Okay. Please. 
Oh. I can see a fallout happening there. Because he just wants to keep going with no interferences. And now I'm about to tell him, time's up for your son. You need to stop the train. He knows. I can't do anything, can I? Kenny. What? Ken. What the hell's that? Your son's blood. Get out of here, Lee. You know he's dying. Nobody knows shit. He'll be fine. Wake the fuck up, man. This is over. He's dead. Don't you tell me to wake up. I got a real family I'm trying to protect. Not that fucking sham you're running back there. Oh. Oh, ho, ho. Calm down and... How the fuck do you calm down after a day like today? By talking to your friend. What is the goddamn deal? He's a little sick, but we can't just quit. It's a scratch. He's not like the others. Jesus, all y'all are just making it worse. Stop the train. Stop it, goddammit! Fuck you, Lee. You're gonna listen. Or what? I'm gonna have to beat him up, aren't I? No, I, I, I don't... Fuck, fuck it. You acting like nothing's wrong. Somebody's gotta knock some sense into you. Ow. Just leave me the fuck alone! I don't need you, and Doc doesn't need you! I told Kaja I'd get you to stop this, and you bet your ass I'm gonna. Give a fuck that we don't get along. I'm not letting you do this to Cat and Duck. You want to hurt people because you're afraid. Losing Duck ain't enough for you. Because you're fucking lose everything acting like this. I'll fucking kill you before I let that happen. I think I just showed it. I'm sorry. Then I apologize, you know. I don't want to not send it. Here we go, here we go. Why is this game emotional, man? The boy's been bit. Oh. In case you haven't figured that out. We shouldn't waste time. There ain't none left to waste. I'm saying we shouldn't stay put. What are we gonna do? We can't allow him to become one of those things. But... What if... what if he doesn't? Kenny, I love you very much. I love our son more than life itself. I need you not to dog. hear me. What you are saying, that he may not turn, is foolish. But... No. There's... Come on, Cat. If you think of one, you let me know. Isn't there some sort of pill or something we can just give him? Stop it. Just drift off to sleep. 
right, hon? I mean, Jesus, this is our son. I know, but we know it's here or nothing. Oh, fuck. Just who, then? You want me to? You don't have to. I'll do it. No, you don't have to. God, you fuck. I, I, I can. I can do this. You can't. I love you, Ken, but this is beyond you. I'll do it. No, it should be apparent. No parent should have to do something like this. He's right, Cat. We can say our goodbyes and just let that be it. I don't know. Lee, you'd be doing this family a great service. Why don't we take him into the forest so Clementine doesn't have to see? Yeah. Give us a moment to say goodbye. Of course. I actually feel quite sad. Clementine's friends being take, taken away. There, they've lost their son. Duck is dying. Let's be honest with her. I know. What are you doing? I'm gonna make sure he's okay. But how? He's bitten. By making sure he doesn't come back. Oh. Look, Clem. Things are... What the... No! Ben, huh? take Clementine into the train. Go. It'll be fine. Cat! Cat! Gotcha! What? Why? Cat! Honey! Uh. Oh, fucking God! <laughs> What the oh, hell happened? What did you? She could. She 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 just. Oh, oh, oh fuck! She killed herself. She couldn't kill her son. So she killed herself. What do we do? Give me the gun, kid. I'll do it. Go on, mate. You, you go back. Hopefully he doesn't watch. Hopefully he don't watch, because... Can you not, like, go back or anything? Okay. I wanted to just walk away and leave him there. Why was you watching? Ah. Uh, I don't even know what to say. Our whole family unit of 
um, that guy, Ben, is it? The old man, and Kenny. I'm gonna look, obviously, you want to talk? Uh -uh. I'm always gonna look you after this girl. Understand what happened? Yes. Okay. What do you think it's about? What Chuck said. What Chuck said. That what happened to Duck would happen to me. The fuck he what? did. I swear. Sorry. Took some sense into it. Don't be mad. Hey. How you doing? Don't talk to my girl. Just stay away from her. Excuse me, son? I heard you told her she was gonna die. That she was gonna end up like Duck. Why'd you go and do that? Because she is. I don't know much about you folks, but I can tell you as sure as the sun's gonna come up tomorrow. But y'all keep going on like this, and that girl ain't gonna make it. What do you know? I know that you don't have a goddamn plan. We get to Savannah, and then what? We find a boat. You think that's a new idea? You got even the foggiest idea about where you're gonna find one of those. Look, sit down with the girl and hash it out. Find a map, for Christ's sake. I'd give you one if I had it. And if something were to happen to you... It won't. If it were, you gotta prepare the girl. Teach her to use a weapon, and for crime, and he cut that hair. Are you listening to me? For fuck's sake, I shouldn't even have to be telling you this. Find some scissors in my pack and take care of that hair before a walker does it for you. And then show her how to use a gun. Because like it or not, that's what saves your life from here on out. All right, I'll do what it's you true, say. It's true, it's true. You're gonna live with the consequences either way. I don't mean to tell you how to do your job. But too many people have died already. They have. Seeing another little girl die might just do me in. I hear you. A plan, a haircut, and a gun. It's good advice. It is good it's advice. Something. It is. Wow. Be safe up here. You betcha. Oh. I see how he is before I go past him. Hey. hey. It'll be good to get to the water. I wanted to talk to you about keeping my past from you all. You told us it was your parents' store back in Macon. That was enough personal information. I'm sure Cat would be uh, okay with you. So forget it. Okay. There we go. Go find that backpack. We've come in time to an aircut. Hey, Ben. Hey. Doug saved your life, but there aren't many of us left. There aren't many of us left. Yeah. You, me, and Kenny. Clementine. The homeless dude, if he sticks around. We're all homeless. You know what I mean. There's not much use in describing people by who they were. Yeah, I guess not. Doug saved your life, you know. I know, I know. I don't know if I can go on like this, man. Well, you're gonna. That's just the way it is. See you. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Nice little conversation there. Clam, clam, clam. Did you talk to him? I did. He had some, uh... He explained himself and made some good points. Look, we're not gonna let anything bad happen to you. But there are some precautions we have to take. Okay. Yeah, that makes sense. 
Don't worry, sweetheart. Okay, what should we do? Well, we'll figure out a plan for when we get to Savannah. Teach you how to protect yourself and uh, tidy up a little so you can't get grabbed so easily. I like that. Good. Good. You need to know how to protect yourself. Like hiding or running away? Got it. <laughs> Got it. I mean, with one of these. First, don't be afraid of it. It's just a thing. Take it. But know where your finger is all the time. And don't put it on the trigger unless you want to hurt somebody. Okay. Okay. See? It's not scary. It's heavy. You'll get stronger. To aim, you look right down the top, through that notch. Line up the sight at the end with your target. Is there anything else I should know? When you're ready to shoot, make sure you're not breathing too hard. And then hold your breath right when you pull the trigger. Like when I'm swimming? No, just for a quick second. I found that if I did that, I was a lot more accurate. It's tough, but it'll help. I can do that. I was thinking okay. aim for the head, but Shielding knows about... Obviously, you have to destroy the brain, so... Good. Don't lock your elbows. Okay, let's take your first shot. Squeeze the trigger smoothly and I'll cover your ears. Nice and easy. Nice and easy. <laughs> you okay? My hands hurt. I don't like this. Let's stick with it, okay? Do I have to? Yeah, you do. Uh, Bit to the right. Okay, a little higher. Okay, aim a little bit more left. to the left. Aim and lower. There we go. I got it. Excellent. Good shot. to the left. Close. Now keep it steady. There we go. There you go. Nice. Okay, go on. You get, get it this time. Get it this time. There we I go. I did it! Yeah, you did. Learning. Good job. I was holding my breath and the gun didn't shake so much. See? You did good. They're not walkers, though. No, far from it. But you know how these things work now. We'll graduate you to walkers one day. Okay, I feel good. Not so scary, huh? Nuh-uh. not safe that's not nice what? <laughs> are you saying it smells no because it does kinda do you remember when Andy st. John grabbed it and I got mad yeah well that could happen again and if it's a walker well, we need to trim it just a trim right I need to cut it short enough so that it can't get grabbed Okay. Mind if we do this now? I guess not. Don't mope. It's a good thing. Do you know how to do this? How hard can it be? I'm going to look like a boy. Shush now. <laughs> So you did kill someone before. Yeah. You could have just told me. I wouldn't have been afraid of you or anything. I'm sorry. You've killed lots of things now. It 
doesn't even matter. That's true, in a way. You're right. Before all of this, I was sent to jail, you know? Did people ever go to jail when they shouldn't? All the time. Okay. I think I'm about done. I can probably tear these pieces back with something. Here, I have some hair thingies. You do? Hair yeah, thingies. Yeah, really gave them to me for sleeping. There, all set. Does it look dumb? <laughs> no, you look cute. And a lot harder to grab. Oh, Sorry about your hair. I think it looks cute, though. My mom isn't going to like it. I need to look around for a few things that'll make sure we're prepared when we get to Savannah. That would be good. I hope it's safe there. God, me too. Don't we all? Don't we all? It's a fifth of whiskey. Now what do we do? Hey, hey. See you. That was yeah. the best conversation in history. Hey, Ben. See ya. Hey. Yeah? You still want to get a boat? It's still the best plan. Can. It's the best plan. It is a good plan getting the boat. Are there any maps up here? I don't know. I just uh, want to look over one with Clem so she has a lay of the land once we get to Savannah. Mind if I get by you for a second, Kitty? Can you just leave me alone? Come on, Ken. You mind if I look in there for a second? I really wish you'd just leave me alone. I'll uh, talk to you later, Kenny. Oh, uh, so I'm gonna have to talk to this guy. It's the only other thing left to talk to. Well, the girl can shoot. Doesn't have to be pretty. Probably will be before too long. You have any family? Out this there is probably just to find somewhere. out about him, maybe. Been sort of on my own for the past. So, 14 years now. Sorry to hear that. No one to blame. Where are you headed? Uh, that way. I mean when we get to Savannah. We got a few ideas. We'll have a talk when we get there. About whether or not you folks want company. I shot the kid, you know. I suppose someone had to. What a mess. You said it. Be safe up here. You betcha. I'm not having a conversation about him being homeless. I found this if you want it. Damn. Didn't realize I had it left. Thank you. Want a nip? I love a bit. This was before Corona, so... Sure. Ooh. Not known for its finish. No kid. Mm. Anybody in there want to share a drink? You let them know. Will do. Now I've got to go ask if people want to drink. Ah, oh, this could be how I could get that map. Kenny, my boy. Chuck wanted to know if you needed a drink. He's got some. 
Go on. Go on. There we go. Yeah. That'd help. Get that map. Uh thanks. Go let Ben know if he wanted a drink. Hey Ben. Hey. See ya. <laughs> well, it looks like he ain't having yeah. a drink. Okay. Oh, I've got a map now, aren't I? So I need to talk to everyone with Clem. It was me. Huh? I was the one giving the bandits supplies. What? Oh. It's all my fault. Dog died. Why the hell would you do this? They said they had my friend, that he was with them. By the time I realized they didn't, it was too late. They said they'd kill me, kill all of us. I'm sorry, Lee. You still want to talk to me? I don't have a lot of choice, unless you're going somewhere. I... I guess I'm not. What are you doing out here? I, uh, couldn't be back there anymore. I needed some air. Anything else? I was thinking about talking to Kenny. I guess not. I'm dead serious about you keeping your mistakes to yourself. I can tell. You get why, right? I guess. You better. See you. Yeah. If anybody else finds out that it was him, in, in the end of the day, what's happened has happened. We can even make it worse or make it better. But what I am thinking is it could always do it again. So that's up there. I'm thinking that. Hey, Clint. Hi. I want to talk about Savannah. Me too. And what we're going to do when we get there. They don't know what to expect. The city could be bad or totally under control. The thing is, you and I, we're a team, you know? And a team needs a plan. Aside from everyone else, when this train stops, you and I should know exactly what we're doing. A plan. I like it. <laughs> Good. We should go our own way when we get there. The crew is falling apart. You and I are stronger alone. What about the boat? What about Ben? You'll be fine. Okay. Can we at least look for my parents when we get there, before we go? Okay, we'll look for them. But then we're moving on. Really? Yes, of course. Sorry. Let's look at the map. If we can figure out where they were, we can start there. Okay, let's. Looks like we'll come right through town if there's nothing on the tracks to hold us up. And unless Savannah is somehow walker free, we know we want to stay out of town. Are we going to have to live in the woods? You don't like the woods? I don't like the woods. Well, what I think we should do, after we look for your mom and dad, is head north. Keeping water, the, the ocean on our right side. So we can't get surprised by walkers. Exactly. I like the beach. Good. Now we've got a good chunk of Savannah here. What do you think? They always stay in the same place when they go there. It's, uh... Hmm. Hey, don't worry. We'll figure it out. Have you ever been there? Once. Well, think about it. There are a lot of hotels on here, but read this map. So I'm, I'm on about going my own way now, just They've because got really about... tasty desserts. Ben's a feast. called the... Um, 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 something Mar. Is, is, is this is, is, the Marshall? Is... Yes, that's it. So we'll uh, I don't there. know about Kenny. Yes. You think we have a good plan? Starting to think otherwise of them now. Very good. 
Chuck's gonna I probably tell my parents? wander off somewhere. You know. Sure. Go ahead. All right. How do you feel? Good. Better. I'm glad we have a plan. And you're a good little chef. Thanks. I guess we should see how far. Oh shit! Hold on, everybody. That doesn't seem good. <sighs> What's this then? Well, that's not good, is it? Fuck, 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 fuck! I think he's a little cranky. Walk. That's fucking stupid, Ben. I'm just saying. Hmm, I don't know. I ain't got much experience with y'all's fortitude, but we could probably deal with that. We got a goddamn train. That thing's not full of milk, Charles. That's gas or diesel. Something that's gonna explode. You gotta get a hold of yourself. This a crew here. This ain't shit. This. Yo! You keep screaming like that, and you're gonna get your face chewed off. Are you guys gonna be trouble? Because we could have just kept walking. Could be. Who are you? Two people who have a strategic position on you. Come on, hon. Let's give these guys a break. We'll see. You guys got a problem with your train? Yeah. You're standing right in front of it. Dude, it's a wreck. It's not so bad from up here. Send your buddy up to have a look. Anything goes sideways up there, we won't let them escape. If I come up there, you better not be murderers or thieves. I guess you'll have to find out. So we've met someone guys new. Is what we need. They're what you think we need. We're doing fine. For now? What about when... Stop it. Hey, dude. I'm Omid. Lee. Krista. What's the deal with the train? We're driving it. Oh, man. Look, y you want to help us out? We could use some able bodies and... Yeah, we, we really need some help. What's in it? Oh shit! God damn, you guys have a kid! What are you doing up here? Do you know how long it's been since I've seen a kid? Shit! What's your name? Clementine. Oh, so he gets to swear. Oh, this is great! <laughs> See? Things are looking up. You're not her dad. He down there? It's that obvious? To me. And no, he's not down there. Huh. What's your story? I found her hours I came across Clementine alone. First day all of this happened. I was actually incarcerated. Sick. Do you have any prison tats? I uh, didn't make it that far. And everybody down there, they're cool? We just met Chuck, but he mm. seems like an alright guy. You always have to worry about new people. I used to love meeting new people. That must have been a long time ago. We're sorry for anything that's happened to you guys. A train is awesome, though. A tank is your real problem. We'll help you with it. But if we see anything we don't like, we're moving on down the road. Alone. We'd appreciate the help. You can't just blast through it, I guess? If you could get it down, the rest would probably be pretty easy. We'll start there. We'll come down and settle in and see if we can help. Cool, cool. It's empty. Ah. What's this? Oh, that's cool. And there's nothing here. That's about the only useful thing in here. Uh. Empty. 
That's what I figured. So I'm just gonna scan scan around, make sure there's anything that I could take. Anything would be useful. There's no way I'm pulling anything apart down there. Damn right. Let's go hmm. talk to your people, man. Oh, me? What? So, yeah, it's, uh, looks like we do have to talk. So, let's go back down. Guys, this is old Mead and Krista. Not big on welcomes? Like I said, we could use some good people. We just wanted to say hi and say your train is pretty cool. But we're not looking for charity. We could help you guys, though. Maybe. So, yeah. Hi. Uh, again? It's time we move forward. Omid and Krista are gonna help and we're gonna get past this damn tanker. We're happy to stick around. We'll see about that. You wanna start in on that tanker? I'll get to know the girl for a minute, if you don't mind. And why don't I show you how this thing works, in case something happens. Really, Ken? It's probably for the best. Someone might wanna have a look inside of that station back there, too. Sounds great. Let's do this thing. So... This would create one hell of a fireball if we tried to blast through. Yeah, so obviously I'll take it, we're not... We aren't blasting through, so... Oh. Can I follow you over there? You don't like the new girl? I do. But it's like we're a team, like you said. Yeah, all right. Come on. Clementine and I are checking out this train station, all right? Hustle over if you hear anything. That's all right. I, I don't mind her coming along with her. So I, now, every time... Somewhere says survivors inside. That there won't be survivors inside. It's like in a movie. Survivors inside. The bloody go in. There's no survivors. They just get eaten. And you should wait for me before trying to open doors. Sorry. Uh, luckily, it's locked. We'll get better at working together. Hmm. Hmm. <clears throat> Won't burn. No. Doesn't look like that thing's worked in years. Not some no go. Oh, there we go. Oh, look at window. The window's open up there. It's Maybe I actual... could look in. Okay. Uh, yes, you. Why don't I put you on my shoulders and you can peek into that window up there? Sounds good. Ugh. Okay, I can see in. What do I do now? Company, what do you see getting this door open? What do you see? Yeah, I Lots of crates there. and stuff. Maybe we can find the key or figure out a way to knock this door down. Kenny'd probably have me pick the lock. Which actually might work now that we have the time. I think I opened it. For real? I think so. <laughs> That's one for them. Well, I'll be damned. Well. Let's go. Be careful. I'm supposed to tell you that. Oh. <sighs> Please Damn, don't make it dark in here. Maybe I can hold the door open? I don't like that. I'll prop it open with something. What will I prop it open with? With that? Okay. Up good. So 
we need. There's some space up there, but not much. We're lucky and so little. Yeah, we are. So we've got to send Clem back up again. I mean, you okay going nothing. over the top of this fence? Yeah, definitely. In there. And <laughs> I guess if zombies come in from my way, you grab the keys, Clem. I guess they uh, come on. scoot. Behind you. <sighs> Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Come oh on, come on, come on. Oh, it was that one. That one got me. Oh. Am I still alive? No, of course not. Right. Go on and grab the keys, Clem. Come on, scoot. Behind you! That is how it's done. It's okay, it's okay. Everything's fine. Oh no. Keats, now! When you press A, the zombie moves out of the way of the sensor or whatever it's called. It's okay, it's okay. Everything's fine. Everything's fine, don't worry. Give me the gun. Keys, now! They all could if they were the wrong keys, wouldn't they? <sighs> there we go. Ooh. God damn. That didn't go so good. No, it did not go so good. But we're okay. Everything's okay. What's going on? I thought I heard a gunshot. We're fine. We found some walkers. You and an eight-year-old versus three of them, huh? We handled it. Yeah, it looks like. What if you hadn't? I'm gonna go make sure the noise didn't cause us any problems. That's a good idea. I hope what you know what you're doing about? with her. We're still alive, aren't we? Yeah, you are. She's got a right problem. Right. Go in there and get some of this stuff. We got it. Let's go outside now. What did we learn? I'm not ready for a gun.
No, Clem. We learned that everything we will ever do is dangerous. We'll get better, smarter, and faster, okay? Okay. Anything else here that we can take? Shelf, no. no. Nothing else that we can actually take, so. Uh, you sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm a little shaky. Another. It'll pass. Alright, let's go then. Oh man. After this, I need a cup of tea. <sighs> I found a blowtorch in the station. Should make quick work of the coupling up there. Let's go out. Excellent. I'll come up there with you to have a look. Don't mind if I do, guys. Just a little, little drink. Why not? Ah. Oh. Right. I mean, is this guy? Think this will work, dude. You're cutting metal with fire. How could it not? Ugh. I don't normally, obviously, do this, but today's been a long day. I've got my kiddies tomorrow, and then Sunday I'm back at work, which is Father's Day Sunday. But I'm uh, <laughs> having a barbecue tomorrow for Father's Day. Um, cause obviously I'm at work Sunday. Shit. What's that? The hose has a leak in it. Turn it off, dude. I, I don't want my eyebrows burned off. Better plug that ah, leak with something. But I picked up tape or something. Stand by. No, we don't. Yeah, I've got tape. This holds. Ah. That's crazy. Look at it go. Just about got it. Whoa, thanks. No sweat, man. This thing is hanging by a thread. The smallest cut, and it'll go. Just about done, too. Oh, wrong one. Crap. I can't reach it now. Can't reach it? Uh. There's nothing we can. Well, there's nothing we can sort do. Fire that thing up. Here, the weak portion of the coupling's out of my reach. You think it'll be within mine? <laughs> no, but I'm gonna dangle you over that ledge. The hell you are! <laughs> yeah, yeah. God, you're a real son of a bitch, aren't you? Shut up and start cutting. That doesn't sound good. That definitely doesn't sound good. Guys! There's something coming! What the what? Thousands. We gotta go! Fuck. Yeah. Oh yeah, me! Do. Cut! Cut! I am! It's going! Pull me up! Kenny, go! Uh -oh. Shit! What the hell do we do now? Oh, to God, this works. Holy crap! We gotta jump! What? No way! Have 
Have it your way. I will! You son of a... <laughs> ah! Oh! Shit! Clementine. We're fine. Just pushed him over the edge and <coughs> almost got him killed. And this must be Savannah. Stop the Atlantic. We're going our own way, Clementine and me. What the fuck does that mean? I just think it's it's time she and I parted ways with you. Old Mead and Krista could make their own call. Huh. I'm sorry. We made a plan. We talked it through. Be all right. I'll be alive, I guess. Blood in my heart. Blood in my brain, at least. I'll leave you to your thoughts. She's out cold like I've never seen. <laughs> That fucking thing was broken. So did I. Who the fuck was that? If he's convinced Clementine that he has her parents. Y'all might want to rethink your plan. Yeah. Definitely might want to rethink. Because that don't seem good at all. Oh, next time. We're almost at the river. You want to get on a boat? You want to wait around till the walkers figure out we're here? We can still leave, Clem. Just you and me. But Savannah's more dangerous than I thought. I don't know how much longer he can keep on like this. If his leg gets any worse, we're gonna have to carry him. Or leave him. If I were you, I'd get out of the street now. Who the hell is this? Answer me, damn it! So when were you going to tell us about the radio? Who have you been talking to? You come back here, I'll kill you. You understand? I will kill you! That looks good, guys. Not going to lie, that looks... That looks good. Okay, looks like we did well again. So, did you shoot the girl in the street? You and 59% of players did not shoot her. Did you abandon Lily? You and 45% of players left her. Pardon me. Did you fight Kenny? You and 54% of players fought him. 
Did you shoot Dalt? You and 81% of the players shot him. I think we all took that burden. Did you help Omid? You and 60% of players helped him. There we go. That was good. Right, yeah, that's it. Well, again, thank you for watching this episode, guys. I hope you have enjoyed. Remember to leave a like and subscribe in uh, on the channel on this video. Um, drop a comment if you've enjoyed this video. Um, I do apologise for jumping again on some part and almost bobbing myself. Uh, some of these parts in this game. Every episode I've had something that's made me jump so far. Getting pretty. I might, I might need to start taking heart tablets for bloody this game. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you on the next one.